guys, I'm Adu playing Devil May Cry 4 Special Edition. This is Mission 16 of my Nero and Dante, Dante Must Die Difficulty Video Guide. Can be a bit of a tricky mission. That's just because the poison's slowly leeching away at your health. If you can't kill the enemies efficiently, then you will struggle a little bit. But it shouldn't be too bad because you do get given a lot of green orbs. Best way to deal with these guys is to shoot them to slow them down, get them out of the ground, and then just wail on them. You can do that with um, either like a prop shredder or you can just launch them with your regular high time, however you want to do it. But you want to slow them down with the guns first. I would be fancy and try and royal guard these guys, but I don't really want to piss around when I'm like going to lose all my health to poison. So I'm not going to. If it wasn't for the poison, I would try at least. But sadly, the poison is just there. This is the easiest, safest way to do it. If they give you the opportunity, that is. Come on, come close. Stay still, stay still. Damn. Come on. Listen, I just don't, I don't like these guys. Like they're just annoying. Like they're a fine enemy. Ah, and they're quite unique, but God, are they annoying? Let's play as Virgil. Then they're pretty fun actually, because you can just just perfect judgment cut them as you can everything else. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, it would be fancy, but. I don't like the poison in this level. Like, I get it. It's meant to say, you know, you've got to be more efficient than you normally would be. But, eh. Just takes away a lot of freedom. Well, it doesn't really. Like, if you're good enough, it doesn't take away freedom. Which is why it's not bad. It's just... And for those who are less skilled, such as myself, it's, uh... It kind of does limit your freedom. <laughs> Fuck off. They should definitely stay out the ground longer than that. Really? This is fucking gay. Okay, I got him, I got him. Do you not know fuck it? Oh man, that fucking hitbox again. What? I pressed <sighs> Kappa Pride. <laughs> Seriously, I genuinely did not press my style button then. I pressed my melee attack. That's fucking horseshit, man. Come on. I couldn't even get a bullet off. How am I supposed to knock you out the ground if they're not staying? Oh. This part is badly designed. Damn. Okay, I've got him. Fuck you, cunt. Okay, I got him. Damn it, I hate that so much. Like, they should give you at least a bit more time. But as you can see, like, it's not a particularly hard mission unless you, like, really struggle at killing enemies efficiently. But it's just... Uh, it takes away the incentive to do, like, stylish stuff, right? It's just like, you know, I might get punished if I try and do stylish stuff. Unless you're, like, super good. But, like, this game wasn't designed for people being super good in mind. Like, it was kind of. But there's plenty of people out there who are competent. Competent, that's the word, competent. But, hey-ho. So this is something I find kind of funny, actually. Um, Nero doesn't actually destroy the dice. Whereas, really? Fuck off, man. Fuck you, I'm out. They weren't even on screen. <laughs> but um, yeah, Dante actually just destroys the dice, whereas Nero can or doesn't. So that implies that Dante is actually stronger than Nero. This fight sucks. Not a fan of it. That's why you just get gang raped by so much shit, man. Uh, what I recommend is I recommend Dark Slayer style to um, deal with the swords. And if they're too far away for you, then you can just use. Um, oh, I missed. That was a missed input for me there. You can just use Pandora to deal with the worst of them. Definitely recommend taking care of um, the Cutlass first or the Gladius. I don't know what they are. Fuck you. It is a tricky fight. I'm not good at it. Come on. Got him. Damn it. I'm actually going to take care of the knights because I can actually... No, I'm not. <laughs> Fuck it. The flying swords are too deadly. I'm going to kill this one because he's low, though. Easy, perfect block. Damn it. I was trying to switch to Royal Guard, but I was apparently already in it. Damn, come on. 
Uh, your tricks to teleport should put you about the right spot for a Helmbreaker to get them out of the sky. Which is the best way of taking care of them, I think. I've completely forgotten about that, but I've just realized that that is indeed the case. Got him. Got him. Got him. <laughs> that wasn't even intentional. <laughs> I was trying to go for the fucking knight there. Come on, lock onto the right guy, Dante. Oh, you dick, come on. <laughs> nice hitbox. Man, the hitboxes in this game are dodgy for Dante. Like, for the other characters, it seems fine on the whole. But for Dante, it just seems a bit... iffy, you know? Oh. Damn it. No, that one. Thank you, Dante. God. Doof. Sorry I'm not talking much. Again, this is just a tricky one. I don't want to have to, like, do a bunch of retakes. I'm kind of tired of retaking the same missions. I mean, for, like, one of the missions, I had to do it, like, seven times. Another, I had to do it for ten times. So, I think you can forgive me for being a bit, uh... Having some trepidation. Doof, got him. But, yeah, this mission's not that hard. If you're actually killing the enemies, if you struggle with actually landing the killing blows, then you're gonna really struggle, because you will just lose some health. And there's just no way around it. Can't remember the route through this. It's been a while. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Oh dear. Angel creation. Okay, I'll try and have a bit of fun here. Can I get behind you? Thank you. Damn it. That's a good spot for jump cancelling, actually. That's the wrong button. Come on, give me a break. Can I just get behind you, please? <laughs> wonder if it's easier in Dark Slayer. Probably. Maybe not. Man, come on. There we go. Really? Oh, come on. Cooperate, there we go. No. Man, I don't know how to jump cancel. <laughs> I'm trying to like, have some fun here, but I'm just not good enough. Again, it's just not a practice thing. I've kind of been considering doing a... Um, I've never beaten the bloody palace as Dante. I always time out. Like I just can't kill the enemies quickly enough. I'm not efficient enough. I'm not that good. But... Um... Oh, he stopped. Come on. Damn it, I was trying to get some Royal Guards going. Whoops. Fuck. Damn! <laughs> Fuck. I tried, man. I tried. You can't say I didn't try in style, at least. I should probably use my other weapons more. I forgot I had them. <laughs> so easy to, like, get caught in, like, trying to just survive... Right, where's Dickhead? Whoa. <laughs> I didn't see him coming. Man, enemies have been, like, attacking from off-screen the whole fucking, like, run. I don't know why. No, he moved. <laughs> he came back. <laughs> he wants to give me a little gift. <laughs> Come on, charge me, bitch. Come on, you can't touch this. Really? Well, if you're not even going to hit your shit, come back. <laughs> Oh, wait, what? Nah, he was definitely in range. That's fucking horseshit, man. I wonder if that's perfect. Probably not. Oh, dear. But yeah, um, where was I? Oh, yeah, I've never... Wait, is it this way? Yeah, it is. I've never beaten the bloody palace's Dante because I always time out. Like, I've just never been good enough at him. And I'm kind of wondering if I should, like, try and do it. And, like, make a montage of all, like, the failed things. That'd be kind of funny. But I know I'd have to do it, like, 20 times or some shit. And I've never done the... Like, I, I did it once with, um, Shadow Dance here. I think it's, like, getting a... Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> I didn't mean... To... The camera angle fucked me up there. Um, 
but yeah, I did it once with like Super Dante just to like see if there was like an achievement or a secret or something. So I was wondering if you like got to fight against Nero if you did the Bloody Palace as Dante, which you don't sadly. But I never actually did it legitimately, so I kind of want to like just do a little uh, thing about that, which would be kind of cool. But then that would like it would just be so much grinding and like trying to get good as Dante, which could be kind of fun, but it's just a serious time investment, isn't it? Bet people would like to see that though. So coming up, we have a very, very difficult fight. It's a bunch of the Hellhounds. I don't know what they're called, but they're Hellhounds, and they are fucking terrifying. Dude. <laughs> yeah, they, it's a really hard fight, and I don't have any good advice for you. You just have to be good. Like you have to be good at dodging, and you have to be really quick. Um, the best thing I can suggest is manipulating your camera to limit the amount of enemies fighting you and to just like pin one down and just get rid of it. Because if you're not super good, then you're going to struggle a lot. But yeah, like this. Just single out one guy. Oh, I, I thought he was going to attack, so I stopped. But yeah, just single out this one guy and just get rid of him and keep repeating that. You see how I've got them right up against the wall? I'm manipulating the camera so that there's not that many enemies hitting me. Or like trying to. Damn. Yeah. Okay, he's dead. Damn it, I can't really manipulate the camera right now. There we go. So yeah, it's just a matter of manipulating the camera and trying to limit the enemies that you're fighting against. Nice, good dodges. Uh, I don't recommend anything but Trickster for this. <laughs> Unless you're really good, obviously. But if you're really good, why the fuck are you watching me play? But um, yeah, I don't recommend anything but Trickster. Like, it's you just need to dodge. That's all it is. <laughs> Man, I love Rogard. It's so much fun. Well, that wasn't so tricky after all. One of these has health, I swear. Is it you? Oh, fuck off. There we go. Man, I love Rogard so much. It's probably, like... It's probably my favourite style. Fuck off. There we go. My yeah, favourite style, just because you can feel like such a badass with some of the shit you can block. I might try and, like, Royal Style against Burial as well. See what I can do against him. Burial is an easy as fuck boss fight. Like, you have no excuse for dying on it as Dante. And I'm saying that now, fully aware that I'm probably going to die. <laughs> but no, on a serious note, like, there is no excuse for dying on it as Dante. You have all the tools to dodge everything he's got. You have distorted real impact for the damage. Like, seriously, you, sh you should be just fine as Dante. Like, it is not difficult. Like, Barry was probably the easiest boss in the game. Could try and think if any others are easier. No, I think Barrier was probably the easiest. Maybe the Savior. Like, if you know what you're doing on the Savior, the Savior is pretty easy, but... The Savior doesn't really count, does it? So, yeah, let's say... Yeah, let's go with that. Barrier was the easiest boss in the game, I think. So, what we're going to do against him is we're going to abuse Trickster Dashes, and we're going to use a mixture of Pandora and Distorted Real Impacts to get secure safe damage and just annihilate him. Easy as that. I'm going to try and style a bit, so I might die just from like trying to Royal Guard his shit, but that will just be me having fun, which, as I'm sure you understand, that's pretty reasonable. And what I'll do is, because I've not done badly on the level, is um, I've got full health and full Devil Trigger, right? So if I die, I'll just use a continue, because I'll have less than I... Oh, I mistimed that. So I have less than I already did. I just want to see like what sort of shit you can Royal Guard. Wait, I definitely pressed B then. Dante went into his stance there. Wow. Okay, never mind. Apparently you can't row guard anything. Can you jump cancel this guy? Come on. Okay. This is how you beat Burial. Aww. Really? Damn it. <laughs> I was fucking around. Alright. Can you not Royal Guard his stuff, man? 
You can't royal guard his stuff, I swear. Man, are you serious? You can't royal guard his stuff. Me! What? I just killed myself. I did not. Me. I swear that I was pressing Royal Guard. Nothing was working. What? <laughs> Can you hear that? <laughs> hang on, hang on. I'm going to turn the um, in-game volume up a little bit. Uh, there we are. <laughs> Can you hear that? <laughs> That's brilliant. But man, like, you can't seem to Royal Guard anything Burial does. What? That's... Is that intentional? Or am I just bad? I'm not playing through the whole mission again to find out, but... What I'll have to do sometime is I'll have to, like, just take a trip to the Bloody Palace as Dante. And, like, just, like, get to Burial. Cause it'll, or I'll do it on, like, Human Difficulty or something. And I'll just try and, like, see what you can and can't Royal Guard. Because maybe my timing was just off. But I swear I saw my animation for it going off. Anyway, that's that mission. I hope to see you in the next video. Cheers, guys.